What can I get you? I've got scotch. I've got whiskey. There's a nice Chablis in the refrigerator. Cut the bullshit. Can we please just cut the bullshit right now? I don't know what you're up to, but whatever it is, it's gonna stop right here, right now. No. It's not going to stop. It's going to go on and on until you face uh, your responsibilities. What responsibilities? What are you talking about? I'm pregnant. I'm having our child. Alex, that's your choice, not mine. I just want to be a small part of your life. And you think this is the right way to go about it? Showing up at my apartment. Well, what am I supposed to do? You won't answer my calls and then you change your number? I won't be ignored. You just don't get it, do you? Don't you remember our weekend? Wasn't it wonderful? Why can't we be like that again? I know you feel it too. You want me. I know you do. Oh, don't flatter yourself. Poor darling. You can't help having dirty thoughts, can you? And poor little Beth. She was awfully sweet. But she was also kind of boring. <laughs> was she boring in bed, too? That's the problem. Go ahead. Hit me! If you can't fuck me, why don't you just hit me? You're a very sad girl, you know that? You are very sad and lonely. Don't pity me. Ever! You smug bastard! I do pity you. You're a very sick girl. Why? Because I, I won't let you treat me like some slut? That you can just bang a couple times and then, then just throw away in the trash can? I'm going to be the mother of your child. I want oh. some respect. Oh, you want respect? Huh? What are you doing? I'm sorry, Dan, okay? I didn't mean it. Just don't go! I'll tell your wife. You do that, and I'll kill you. I swear to God. takes. It's a phone call, Dan. I'm warning you. I won't just, just 